What's up, douches? So, since they're not going to ban my Twitters and my YouTubes, my archive, at least a Twitter. Apparently, all of my views, even my StarCraft views, are coming from that one two-minute video I posted from Death Wish, where Bronson fights the muggers. Everyone's like, it's Ziggy Top, or Iggy Top, or whatever his name is. I don't know. Bunch of Gentile shit. Anyways. I might start doing more short form content. But it has to be on a different channel. This is my rant and take up space on the hard drive of YouTube channel. I was debating getting all my old videos from 2018 and going over them on this channel. Who cares? What it's getting time to do, I might even be a little bit behind now in schedule. Depends on how soon I can finalize some paperwork <clears throat> but it's time for more pro bono work every time these four years some OGs in crypto get together and make memes and spread them on social media Because people are dumb <clears throat> or people have been entrapped in a childlike state for very long and they communicate in pictures. I used to call it woke hieroglyphics or some shit like that. Retarded millennial, retarded zoomer cuneiform. Anyways, this is when I show everyone how to make a bunch of money, and now that all my shit's done, I can cash it out myself, and then we'll figure out what to do with it next. I'm probably going to start looking at a good time to take profit. On Forex, and I'm going to put it all into T drop because it's under a cent. Then I'm going to put as much as I can into T fuel since it's under 10 cents. And I can probably get at least another half a million of that shit before shit hits the fan. And if I get at least 10,000 theta and I have like 10 million T drop. I think I'll be set for the next bull run, and then when I sell it all at the, at the at the good times, the height of it, then buy it again after a year or two. You know, buy at the top, sell at the top of the market, buy at the bottom of the market. Boy, was that pandemic crazy. Four years before the pandemic, 
they were having retards in anime costumes fight each other in public spaces. Literally, they were like, fuck the failed Hillary thing. You didn't work. Bring out the bring out the Civil War. Allegedly. Allegedly. So. What all these memes are supposed to be doing. <clears throat> is bread coming all over you all. See one of the things. One of the things that is the illusion of money is that there's the haves and the have-nots. I'm showing you, I'm the living story of have-not, getting the have, throwing it away, saying it's not the stuff or the stuff that you buy that matters, it's the skill set you had to acquire all that bullshit. Which is why the first thing I did was give it all away, or get rid of it, or let it crash. <clears throat> Just like the Joker burns the pile of cash, and the Batman thingamajiggy, let it all go to zero. Because now you know it's possible. And they can't say it's luck, they have to say it's skill. If it happens again. That's the beauty of Cicada. It's the pawn crossing the board and becoming the king or whatever the fuck. King me. Chess. Chessmate. Anyways. So... I already have an account set up. I have to get a new email. And then I'm going to make silly, stupid memes and religious-themed books that I draw from inspiration from, like, Indo-Greek bullshit and I put parables of, like, saving in crypto and taking profit and all that bullshit. And I'll do it anonymously. The cult of Vecna shall rise again. We're going to have a theme about how plastic-faced bitches who get sold to Disney Studios get in the way of young bitches like Gloria Song and that other bitch out in California, Dumb Drop. But seriously, the meme wars are, are upon us. So I like that I can say whatever I want to say. So I'm going to. But a meme channel, I think it's time I do one. We'll make funny memes. And we'll use AI to make memes. And we'll meme people. And we'll meme people into being successful. Because that's what you got to do. People don't move until you shove their face in it. So just shove your shove everyone's face in a bunch of crypto money and they'll start getting the idea. You don't understand. Like I kind of I could have, but I think I still make the made the right decision. Cause in light of all the stuff going on, it's good to get check marks. Uh, but I'm 40, I'm ready to start cashing out, so we're going to have another rodeo. Crazy meme shit. Maybe maybe in honor of stealth, we'll make it a Blade Runner thingamajiggy. Or, what was it, the first thing, was it Deckard Kane? Maybe we'll go back to Diablo, just to good old times.
but we've we've gone over how to make the money. This will be the third time. So now we're going to have to go over how to spend the money because if we don't spend it, someone else will. See, I was first I was focusing too much on fighting the system. I wasn't thinking about what to do after the system was defeated. The fact that these cycles exist means it's on the the system, the deep state is on the way out. So it's time to start showing people what to do when they wake up and from all that bullshit. Which is not by Lambos. I'm probably going to invest in a bunch of companies and start my own company. That way. When they try to cancel me again. On a big level. I'll just go, go ahead. And they'll be like, what? I'm like, yeah, go ahead. I'm going like, oh, to run your company. It's my company. Yeah. Anyways, oh my god, that sandwich was awesome. I'm going to wait a little bit longer and then go drive my car to the shop, drop it off, Uber back, and let them fix it. I showed everyone last time $5,000 to $1.2 million. It's all on camera. The goal is $10 million. If I could do a million again, that would be rad. The goal is $10 million, though. So let's see how close we can get to that. Follow along if you want to. We're going to make them into memes and all that bullshit. All right, peace out.